Let me ask you a question, Jack. Do you like this place? Oh, it's hotter fish out in town. People love coming here. Do you like it? Personally, I don't really like any restaurant where the plate is heavier than the food. <laughs> well, I couldn't agree more. I don't know why I brought us here. Force of habit, I guess. Do you like it? I loathe it. <laughs> Did you know I was born and raised in Gary, Indiana? No, I always thought that you were... Native New Yorker, family's been here for generations. Yes. Well, that's no accident. I've worked at that. But no, I started out with nothing but ambition. And uh, somehow Clarice spotted me, my rugged good looks, I guess. And we got serious. And she introduced me to the right people, and I made sure those introductions paid off. Well, you're also great at what you do. True. But skill isn't always enough. You're going to have to do the same thing, Jack. To me, we'll insist upon it and get used to places like this. You'll be eating in a lot of them. Crash that social circle. Stay there long enough, and people will forget you're from Kansas. Well, I'm not sure that I want them to. No, yeah, you do. This is a very small world you're moving into. I mean, we all know each other. We're all we want to know. Listen, you could be very happy. You'll have a, a lovely home, a, Beautiful, fascinating wife, a full social calendar, and the ability and potential to make more money than you ever dreamt possible. That's the deal, Jack. And I just thought you should be aware of the details before signing up. I appreciate it. Are you happy, sir? Clarice and I make a good team. I live a comfortable life. I've gotten everything I could have asked for. If that's what you want, Jack, go for it. Demi's mother and I will not stand in your way. We'll leave that decision totally up to you two. Thank you, sir. Let's have some dessert. 